to Philly for work, but my dad has requested books for Christmas. Yes, that is his therapy, his love language. And so I wanted to support a local small owned black bookstore. So I'm at Harriet's in Northern Liberties. This is so cute. I've never been in here. <laughs> this is so cute. Yes, we got her mouth back. <laughs> yes, all right, so you saw that I was at Harriet's. Harriet's was so cute. It just, it was just a vibe, like it just smelled good, it was cute, it was black women, it was books, it was us, it was everything. So let me break down what I bought. I only got three things. I did not OD yet. So, <laughs> um, I was looking at these totes and so I got one of these so I can give my dad the books and this. Um, I still have more books to give him. Unfortunately, they didn't have all the books that he wanted. Oops, dropping stuff. So she wrapped him like this. Isn't this the cutest? Um, this is lavender. I'm gonna, I'm gonna mess this up, hold on. And so they recommended that I get the Nickel Boys. Um, she said it was powerful. My dad does powerful. I think he might've already read it, but we'll see. If he hasn't read it, I will read it just so it doesn't go to waste. So I got that book. People have often, and I will put a picture because I don't see it, they have compared my father to Malcolm X and he actually loves Malcolm X, so that's actually, like, I guess a compliment for him. So he asked for this book um, and they had this like on full display, so I felt like that was a sign. And one thing I got, which I wouldn't give him because it would be no relevance to him, but because I just wanted to support, um, you know, a black brand and, it's about hair, so why wouldn't I? So I bought this. Um, I thought about getting him one too, I did. <laughs> but I think he would be like, what? <laughs> but it's cute, because it's about like, you know, a dad and daughter, so anyway. So that's what I got. I gotta rewrap that, um, and then they give you the their bookmarks, which is really dope. So speaking of parents, I got my mom. I've had this for a while. And she was at my house today, so I had to hide it. But I want to talk to y'all about it because it is the pan to get. <laughs> so I'm not gonna open it because I want her to open it, but um, it is the Our Place pan and I will put pictures of it in the video. If you guys haven't heard it, I feel like it's trending all over YouTube and Instagram. Actually, one of the colors I think sold out this is the sand color, um, the closest I can get to her favorite color. This pan retails for $145, which I think is ridiculous for a pan. <laughs> I say that as someone who bought it. It was on, I did get a sale, they had a Black Friday sale, but I still think almost $200 for one pan is a little ridiculous, but, but, it is supposed to be the pan that takes away all the other pans. So it fries, it boils, it steams, it sautés, it comes with, man, I really wanna open it. <laughs> all right, it's sealed, so I'm not gonna open it, but I was tempted. Um, and it comes with like the steaming pot, the steaming pot, yeah, okay, that's what it's called. The steaming thing, it comes with its own like spoon, it's nonstick. You could see in the videos, things just like glide out of it. So I'm excited for her to open that. She did not ask for it. It was just something that I thought would be really good. Her pans were a little, they needed to be replaced. Um, um, so I got my godson a gift too. I love him. He's just the cutest. Um, when I don't want to wrap anything, I wrap horribly. Um, I got him this. <laughs> Hopefully he doesn't already have it. He's got a lot of 
special people in his life that are gonna spoil him for Christmas. So, so far, I haven't OD'd. Even though his mama thinks I'm gonna OD, but I'm not, I'm not, like, I'm not, I'm not saying um, So this is uh, Little Tyke's basketball, and I think it just would be so cute to see him like try to play basketball. I thought that was fun. I think those are the major, I mean, I got other people gifts, but they're not major. Like, they're not in boxes where I gotta bend down and stuff, you know? Um, so yeah, aside from this pan, my mother also got a camera. So we spent a pretty penny on her, but she, like she says, she deserves it. So thanks for watching y'all. Thanks for coming on my journey to Harriet's. If you're in the Philly Jersey area, please support a black owned, black owned, that's not how I want to say it. Black female owned business. They would just fly in there too, just fly. So I'm gonna go back. <laughs> I wanted to get all the books. I was like, ooh, they're so shiny and pretty. Um, so I'm really happy and excited for this. And I'm excited to get the rest of my dad's books and put them in this. <laughs> he's gonna be like, what? Why are you calling me? I mean, he's not, he not, I mean, he not a Philly native, but he lived there. So it counts, right? It counts? I don't know. See you in the next one. Bye.